The next cranial nerve is the uh, spinal accessory, and this supplies the sternocleidomastoid muscles and the trapezius. And so just inspect the patient, uh, see if there's any obvious atrophy of the muscles, see if one shoulder is elevated higher than the other, which may be a clue. And then you assess these muscles by asking the patient to turn their head to the side. So just turn your head, and you can see the sternocleidomastoid jump out at you. Do that again against my hand, hard as you can. And actually palpate the muscle belly as you're doing that. To the opposite side, same thing, push hard. Okay, good, and we can both see and feel her sternocleidomastoids. We can assess them both together by asking her to put her chin on her chest. And it's important when you do this, you're going to ask the patient to keep their head there. You're trying to resist, but keep your hand behind them. In case they had weakness, you wouldn't want their head to flop backwards. So it's important to be ready to protect. And then the trapezii, shrug up your shoulders. And we see them both come up to the same degree and at the same rate. And then do that against resistance. Push up your shoulders. Good.